The directory in the attendant console is populated via the Cisco Unified Communications Manager. This means that some information in the directory is pre-populated and cannot be amended in the console. It is however possible to add additional information which might be useful to the operators. To get into the contact properties, find your directory entry and you can then either press F12 on the keyboard, click on the contact properties icon on the toolbar or right click and go to contact and contact details. All fields which cannot be edited are greyed out. Other information can be added to any of the other fields which are available. Please note that any information that is entered against the contact is viewable and editable by all operators. If you have information which does not have a specific field, it is possible to rename that field in the preferences. Simply go to Options, Preferences and choose Field Headers. Find the appropriate field that you wish to rename. As an example, I'm going to choose User Field 1 and I'm going to rename it to Manager. Click on OK. When I go back into the Contact Properties, you'll see that User Field 1 is now called Manager and I can enter the required information. Please note that renaming the field needs to be done on all PCs that use the attendant console. It is also possible to add alternative contacts. You can choose an assistant or alternate contact from the directory for each person. To do this, go back into the contact properties, select alternate numbers, and then you can click on add to add an assistant, find the relevant person and choose add. And you can also add an alternate in the same way. Add, and then once again, click add to add that user. Please note that you can only add a single assistant for a contact. However, you can add multiple alternates if you wish to. Once you have added your alternate numbers, you'll notice in your directory screen that you now have a red arrow. This represents that this contact has alternative numbers set. To view these alternative numbers, you can press F2 on the keyboard, or you can right click and go to contact, view alternate numbers with presence. In this screen, you will see the phone status of the primary user. You will see their present status. At the bottom of the screen, you will see the contacts that you have set as assistants and alternates. It is also possible to add notes or an absent message against the contact. You can press Ctrl and N on the keyboard or you can right click and select contact and contact notes. You can enter a contact absent message Once you click on OK, you'll see that a notes icon now appears in the directory. If you hover over this contact, you'll see the absence message which you have typed in. Once again, any notes that have been entered will be viewable and editable by all contacts. Please note that alternate numbers and notes are features that are only available in the Enterprise Edition. You can also see a separate video which will show you how to transfer calls to an alternative number.